Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Cancer. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for August. This is my second one for August. I'll tag the first one to the end if you haven't seen it, but anyhow, this could happen at any time in August. We're just going to see what comes up, okay? So what do we have for Cancer? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We got three cards came out. We're going to go ahead and take those. First card, Cracked Cup, Dissatisfaction with Life. So you're dissatisfied in some situation. Sunrise, new creative ideas, new ventures, and a fresh start. So if you've been dissatisfied with life, which it appears that you have, there the sun's going to come up tomorrow, right? And, and it's going to be better. It's like... The sun will come out tomorrow, right? Uh, new ventures, a fresh start. Things are going to start to get better. Things are going to start to brighten up for you. Interesting. Scissors. Disappointment in some affair. So we have we have dissatisfaction. We have disappointment. Um, I don't know if you've been cut. You know, if you've been cut, you know, somebody's cut you. You know, they've hurt you in some way or you've cut yourself or something like that. Um, I feel like you also need to use these scissors. You may need to cut something out of your life. Okay, what do scissors do? They cut. They cut. So either you're cutting somebody out of your life or somebody has cut you. Oh, there's one hidden underneath it. June. Something has happened in June that you may be dealing with now. Um, something that, I know that it's something that happened in June. Something that happened in June, which has caused you a lot of dissatisfaction. Um, it's caused you some sort of pain. Maybe, maybe it's your new venture starts and started in June as well. Maybe you were already you were cut before that. I put that right above the new ventures, a fresh start. So you definitely have a fresh start here. Um, you could also be dealing with a Gemini or another Cancer, um, or somebody that has Gemini Cancer in their chart. Um, there is some sort of dissatisfaction, but things are definitely going to get better. They are. So, what do we have for Cancer? What do we have for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? What do we have for Cancer? Hit and run. Hit and run. So I'm not sure if somebody has ran away. You know, hit and run could be a one night stand. It could be an accident. This is, you know, you know what a hit and run is. Phone call that changes everything. And we're so we're talking about August. Some of you could be dealing with somebody that, uh, well, if you think about hit and run, you know, they, 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 they do something and they leave without owning up to the consequences, without owning up to it. There's going to be a phone call that changes everything. Somebody's making an escape by the looks of things. Cancer. So, you know, I feel like this is extremely emotional for you. I feel like you may want to hide. You may want to, you may want to hide yourself. Um, you may want to run and hide. You may want to run and hide. Um, yes, I was just looking at those claws. You know, I don't know if you've hurt somebody or they've hurt you, but there's some sort of pain here. There is. Let's get one more card with the, with the scissors and that, that crab, you know, which is your energy. Um, one, 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 instant manifestation. Some of you may, be, may have just become independent. One is a very independent number. Okay, singular, even though this is one, one, one. 
be it pay, really pay attention to your thoughts at this time because your thoughts become things. That's a card of independence. It's a card of manifestation. Whatever you're thinking, you are definitely manifesting. It's right next to that cancer card. So you're manifesting right now. Somebody has abandoned you, it appears to me, because that hit and what run is in the past. It feels like they've ran away from you. They've, they've run away, you know. They, they hit you and they run, you know. They, they hit, it hit you hard. Whatever it was, it hit you really hard. It was a strong hit. Empress reversed, so I'm not sure what is going on here, but this is uh, some sort of loss. It is some sort of loss. It's emotional. It's very emotional. Some of you, if you are if you are a masculine energy watching this, you're dealing with a feminine energy who's not very loyal. This person is not loyal. This person is selfish may have affairs we have somebody here that has affairs that is disloyal that um is a needy uh forceful very very needy controlling um doesn't offer unconditional love this is a termination could even be a miscarriage there's there's some sort of lack of growth uh, something didn't grow so it may have ended prematurely I feel like we also have a sad mother here. There's definitely a feminine here that doesn't know her value, that doesn't know her worth, that um, lacks self-esteem that is that is having affairs I don't know who that is this is somebody who needs constant attention and maybe this person needs constant attention this could be you it could be you if you're a feminine energy needs constant attention because they lacked a mother's love or a mother's nurturing when they were a child this is an absent mother energy it could also there could also be a wife or a girlfriend here that is very needy this person is needy they're possessive they're high maintenance you know they're 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 trying to force something trying to force something to grow that isn't growing let's get one of these let's get one of these for cancer in some sort of pain for sure I feel like you're in some sort of pain over a loss You're going to be receiving a phone call if you haven't already that changes everything. Um, it's very emotional. You may want to run and hide. It has to do with a hit and run of some sort. And hit and run can be, it doesn't have to be an accident. Making an escape. Somebody is making an escape. They, they may not... Uh, want to put in effort into a situation with that empress reverse this is not unconditional love it's not anyhow um affirmations affirmations we got the affirmations card i'm going to go ahead and read that for you Human beings are conscious creators. We have the potential to shift a negative mindset to positive. Remember I said that 111, you're manifesting. Be careful. Your thoughts become things. You know, we have this empress in reverse that may definitely be in a negative mindset. There's something that isn't growing. It's not growing and trying to force it is not going to work. Anyhow. We have the potential to shift a negative mindset to a positive, adjusting our thoughts and subtle brain waves through positive mantras. We are able to retrain our brains after trauma. 
kick bad habits habits and set positive goals and intentions i do feel like there's some sort of traumatic situation here i do We can change our perceptions by creating positive word sequences to alter our belief systems. That's where that one, one, one comes from. Your thoughts become things. You need to master your emotions. And, and you know, if you think about that cancer card, you think about chari the chariot, you have the ability to control yourself. But I feel like there's, you know, when you get the Empress reverse, that's not mastering emotions. It's not. Interesting. You can change your perceptions by creating positive word sequences to alter our belief systems. The power of the I am presence has the potential to shift, awaken, and align our soul's blueprint, pr blueprint to our physical being. The I am presence is the higher aspect of ourself that connects directly to the God or to God. Invoking the I am presence connects us with God, the universe, our higher self, and to other realms of consciousness. Using the I am presence gives you affirmations, gives your affirmations power. I am strengthens your psyche on a conscious and subconscious level, creating power and intent with every statement. Previously, you may have tried using affirmations but lost motivation due to lack of results. The key to success is to consciously remove words with negative connotations. True affirmations are spoken with belief in your heart's core with no doubt placed upon their words. Right now, your higher self is asking you to be serious about your intentions. To create a positive and open mindset, perseverance will and patience is required that's why the cancer card is probably here because you have the strength to do it i know that you do anyhow like the caterpillar transformation takes time if you want long lasting results acknowledge any thoughts feelings and possible resistance to positive statements if you are in a state of conflict, ask yourself questions about why you feel this way and how you can cooperate to achieve the best possible outcome. Creating conversations with the self is the only way, in this way, supports deep change and resolution to past patterns and behavior. So you definitely have some sort of power during this month to manifest something but you can't force things at the same time because the Empress Reverse tries to force things. You have to be open and you have to think positive. You can't put a name on it. You can't put a name on it. You have to, you have to focus on yourself because like I said, one is a number of self. You need to use your positive thoughts to create the life that you want. Do not put any negative um, wording in your manifestations. You can't say, I don't want. You can't say, you know, you can't say anything negative. It's all going to be positive, all of it. You can't say, I am not good enough. I am good enough. You can say, you know, you have to say, I am good enough. I am beautiful. I am love. I am worthy. You know, that kind of thing. Five of Pentacles, abandoned, ghosted, ghosted, left out in the cold. We have somebody here that has been refusing to accept help. They have been in a victim mentality. And I'm pointing a finger at you. Knight of Cups reversed. No, King of Cups reversed. In the present. Woohoo! King of Cups reversed in the present. That is scattered emotions. Emotions all over the place. Somebody needs help. 
Somebody, Five of Pentacles is about needing help, refusing to accept help. Victim mentality. Unable to master emotions at this point. I feel like you have the opportunity, you can. I think that you're strong enough to. But I feel like with the, with the King of Cups reversed, that is emotional withdrawal. It is uh, lack of communication. It is uh, not... Uh, it's closed down, emotionally shut down, emotionally uh, unavailable, blocking emotions. Detaching. I wonder if you're detaching yourself. You know, some of some of you could be drinking a lot or overdoing it with some sort of drugs or alcohol to mask some sort of pain. There is a victim mentality here. There is a need to master your emotions. There is. And maybe seek help. Seek guidance. Go ask for help. Ace of Wands reversed in the future. So that's a lack of growth. There is, a, and there is with the Empress as well in the future in reverse. We have a lack of growth here. Something isn't growing. There's, there's, a, there's something that is going south. There's no passion. There's no desire. There's no, there's no spark. It's like it's going out. The flame is going out. This, the, the, the drive, a loss of drive, a loss of desire. You know, you need to. Uh, Think positive. The Ace of Wands reverse is, is negative. Okay, upright is positive. Positive. You need to think positive. You need to you need to master your emotions. Perhaps ask for help. I'm a victim to this circumstance. If you choose to be a victim to this circumstance, well you are. You can choose not to. You can choose to go in and ask for help. You can go. You can choose to accept so accept something. But I feel like there's somebody who doesn't want to accept. Eight of Swords. Oh. Mental turmoil. Three of Wands. Page of Cups. Thank God in the future. Fool. Knight of Wands reversed in the present. So moving really fast, wanting to move fast, needing to slow down. This could be your hit and run. Some of you are in a hurry. You're in a hurry. You don't want to wait. You don't want to wait for love. Maybe you've been abandoned. You've been neglected. You know, when you rush, speeding causes accidents. The Knight of, Knight of Wands is like speeding. Okay, so I'm not sure if somebody is speeding here. You know, I think that you've been set free. You know, there's because the Fool card is from something that you have been tied to. There's a lack of healing here. There's a lack of inner love. I feel like you're having a hard time uh, refocusing. I feel like you need to slow down. You need to uh, heal your heart. Take a time out. Maybe accept help. Maybe... Uh, uh, master your emotions in some way you do need to master your emotions i feel like you're looking for love it's like i got somebody here that is looking for love they're, they are definitely looking for love but they're not even emotionally available themselves this is a codependent situation it's like no oh, i don't want to be alone you know i've been abandoned you know and it hurts it hurts so i feel like i feel like there is somebody here that has cut you or you've been cut free from a situation and now you're in a hurry you're in a hurry to get bound to somebody else, okay? I feel like we definitely have somebody here that's going to take advantage of you. They're going to see your victim mentality. They're going to see your vulnerability. This person does not have good intentions. And maybe that's what you did in the past. Maybe you were in a hurry. You got yourself involved with somebody. And, and now you're paying the price. I feel like you need to not repeat those same mistakes and move slowly into a new existence. I feel like you need to be patient. You need to be patient. I feel like you should be focusing on your future, but you should not be hurrying into your future. Don't push it. Don't, don't, don't. There's no need to hurry. I feel like you have big plans, right? You're, you have big plans for the future. You should not be looking back. Do not look back at whoever it was that burned you. You've been burned. I feel like you've been burned by somebody. 
you know, and it's caused, and now you're dealing with that trauma. You're still in some sort of pain with the Empress reverse. The pain has not been released. It has not been delivered. Still in pain. Still in pain. So I feel like you're still in some sort of pain over being abandoned or ghosted from somebody. But this, 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 this didn't grow for a reason. It wasn't healthy. Okay. It wasn't healthy. It wasn't. If it wasn't, if you were in a situation that isn't healthy and it gets terminated prematurely, there's a reason for that. There's a reason for that. If there's, if somebody, you know, isn't taking care of themselves or they're having affairs or whatever, that's not healthy. It's not healthy. Anyhow, um, the fool is starting with a clean slate. I feel like you've been, a, you've been, somebody has left. They, maybe they've left you. They've left you. Uh, they've set you free in some way or you've left, embarked on a new journey. This could go either way. Um, I feel like you need to move very, very, very slow. You do not go fast. Do not go fast at all. Because if you do, I feel like, I mean, I have to be honest, with hit and run in this Knight of Wands reverse, there could be an accident. This is somebody's not looking where they're going, you know? And accidents happen in many different ways. It doesn't have to be a car accident. There could be an accident. I feel like we have somebody also that is self-medicating. They're self-medicating and they really need to slow down. They need to slow down. Um, Knight of Wands reversed is out of control. Sudden departure. I feel like there has been some sort of sudden departure. If there hasn't, there may be in, in the near future. Nine of Swords. Nine of Swords is worried, depressed, regrets, a lot of regrets, having a lot of regrets. Uh, you are in a place where, I mean, we got the ten of, ten of Cups in reverse on the bottom. You may be experiencing a lot of regrets. What if I would have done this different? What if I would have done that different? You know, I feel like you need to focus on yourself right now. I feel like... Uh, There's some sort of abandonment here where you need to, I feel like you need to take a time out. You need to take a time out. You need to focus on yourself. You need to focus on healing your heart in some way. I feel like you're in some sort of pain from a serious loss. It's either, it's of a feminine, you know, or a mother's love. There's a, some sort of loss here. Could be a mother, could be a child. There could also, we also have somebody here that is experiencing regrets, a lot of regrets. I don't know if they've cheated. Maybe they've had sex with somebody else. They had a one night stand. That's what it looks like to me for some of you. Somebody has had a one night stand and they've been set free because of it. That hurts. That hurts. I do believe that, um... Uh, You need to focus, you need to refocus, you need to plan for your future, you need to work on your self-healing. You do, I feel like there's self-healing that is needed. I, there's broken relationship here, there's, there's the, five, the Ten of Cups reverse, that is, that is relationship problems, a dying dream, somebody leaving the end of a relationship. I feel like you've experienced the end of a relationship, you know, and, and, not, and it's time to go, it's time to go. Maybe some of you need to go south. Because the Ace of Wands reversed is going south, going, it's time, you know, and maybe something went south. It went south, it went south. Somebody, you know, did something very reckless. They did something spontaneous without thinking. And now they're having regrets for doing it because I feel like they've gotten caught. I feel like they've gotten caught for doing what they did. Age of Cups in the future. That is support, an offer of love. So there, I feel like there is somebody around you that you may not see that is going to come into your life in the future. Maybe it's three months from now. I feel like it's three months from now. There is somebody that is after after you uh, break free from this mental turmoil and step into new territory right now you're staying put right now you're in a victim consciousness somebody is they're in victim mentality they need to 
uh, let it go because the fool is about letting it all go starting a new journey taking the experience but nothing else it's time maybe it's time for you to travel to go someplace else to just leave it all behind leave it all behind okay leave it all behind you can't it's over okay the fool is the beginning of a new journey but you have to be focused forward okay the don't look back the three of wands right in the middle is do not look back you can't go back you can't go back you can't go back and i feel like we have somebody here that that is having a hard time accepting that they can't go back they can't go back it's been done it's too late whatever that is it's too late it's too late you can't it's too late. Ace of Wands reversed. No growth. No, no passion. No action. Focus on yourself. You got there's a there's there's extreme worry here and I feel like this worry is about it's like extreme I feel like there's impulsive behavior here very impulsive there's that has that somebody has done something very impulsive or they're doing it now this is reckless inappropriate behavior There's reckless, un inappropriate behavior here. I feel like we have somebody here that has slept with somebody. I feel like they have slept with somebody. And uh, because of it, and I don't know if it's you or somebody else, it's caused somebody to break free. You know, or they've been pushed away. You know, they've been forced. They've been forced. They've been forced to leave, you know. sudden departure we have a sudden departure here and having extreme for regrets I don't know if we have somebody here that you know had a secret admirer or they had a secret affair and that's what it feels like I feel like we have somebody here that had a secret affair and they it gets caught they get caught and that's what that's what causes the loss this is a loss but you do have a new opportunity with the page of our page of cups the page of cups is an offer of love it's typically good news I feel like you have some support around you it is in the future it's either three weeks or three months and three weeks probably isn't good okay because if you see you guys wanting to move fast I want this I want things to change really 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 fast that's what got you in trouble last time. This Nine of Swords is like, I wish I wouldn't have done that. I wish I wouldn't have done that. You know, and, and, so, and, and I, feel, I feel like there's going to be some regrets for rushing into something with an individual that is heartless. I feel like this person is heartless. Cold, detached. I feel I I, I feel like you need to focus on self love. We have somebody here that is refusing to get help. They are trapped in mental turmoil. They have been con restricting themselves, uh, confining themselves, choosing to uh, wait, wait for something to, to happen, um, choosing not to see, choosing not to see that they needed to get out of a situation, that this wasn't healthy. Somebody's been in a victim mentality, blaming themselves when they could have gotten help a long time ago. There's no looking back now. It's too late.
somebody's done something super impulsive and they're gonna regret it if they haven't been caught yet I believe they're gonna get caught if somebody has been cheating having sex with somebody else they're gonna get caught if it hasn't happened already you know if they're happy if they're in a third party situation I feel like the third party is going to act on their feelings they're gonna express they're gonna tell I feel like they're gonna tell and it's gonna cause a problem sudden ending just like that so there's gonna be a, if it hasn't happened already there's a sudden ending here there's a sudden ending um, you're gonna be starting on a new journey but I think you're very reluctant to do so I feel like you're very 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 reluctant to do so I think that you have a bright future ahead you do where you're gonna you're gonna you know receive some sort of emotional support from somebody this person is probably younger than you there's a little bit of an age difference maybe not much I think that there's there's you're gonna there is love in the future I would say that it's uh, I'm gonna say three months it, it does feel like it's three months because I feel like there's big healing that is needed it's not time it's not time with the Empress reverse it's not time it's not you don't try to rush into something or you will regret it and that's 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 what I got here and I feel like you've done this I feel like you've been through this before anyway somebody's gonna receive a phone call that changes everything I think that it has to do with a love affair okay could also have to do with a mother or a child okay a mother or a child um, somebody is is leaving they're leaving very very suddenly um, it's like the fire is is gone or the fire is being put out you know um, it's very sudden it's a sudden departure we do have a sudden departure here um, somebody could even end up in jail or prison when I see the eight of swords and the nine of swords there's bars here there's bars so I wonder if somebody's doing something extremely reckless with the Knight of Wands reverse, that is thinking, that is like totally not even thinking. This is like crazy. It's crazy. So somebody could definitely end up with, with handcuffs on. They could end up in jail because they're not, they're acting very impulsively. It, with the fool as well. I mean, oh yes, we have impulsive behavior here. Where there's somebody could, you know, somebody could even end up in the hospital with this Nine of Swords. Okay. There could be somebody that's going to the hospital. They're they're and they you know maybe, you know it's because they were going too fast. Slow your butt down, okay. Especially if you're driving, do not go fast. Do not go fast. We could have somebody here that is, uh, I don't know. Hopefully they're not looking at their phone. This Eight of Swords person appears to be looking down. Uh, do not text and drive, okay? Because there could be an accident where somebody ends up in the hospital and then they end up in jail. Good luck. Hopefully they don't kill a mother or a child or something like that. Good luck.